to go to the party. If we don't get an immediate post-exposure prophylaxis, we will die. Hello, Lance? Yeah, hi. Can I get a taxi at 15? What is wrong with you? Shut up. Let's just get this over with. I'm late. Stop being so paranoid. You're the one sneaking out. Just because the sun isn't setting tonight doesn't mean you can do whatever you want. We wouldn't even be in this mess if you just... You were supposed to be asleep. When are you ever awake past time? Mom asked me to look out for you. There. Taxi. Where's your health card? Okay. Hospital and then straight home to recover. I hear that this shot is really... I'll tell. You'll tell. More like I'll tell. Run my fingers through his gray beard. So wise. Hold his mind in my. Call him by his real name. You read my diary? No more Mr. Stenson. Eric. Eric. You bitch. I'll tell him. I'll tell everyone that you have a crush on a disgusting old teacher. The married one. Coming! You wouldn't. Are you sure about that? I'm going to the party. Hey Lance, just give me a sec. I'm just gonna wash my face. You're not Lance. Have you seen my dog? Oh, okay. Um, well, she was the baby of her family. Had two older brothers she adored who were like 10 and 12 years older. Who babied her to the point of domination and then went away to school. And as far as she was concerned, abandoned her. Left her all alone to deal with her infantile, incompetent parents, just as their marriage was turning into an ugly suburban nightmare. Who was pampered and pretty and all that, but felt worthless and undeserving anyway, and would do anything for attention, even if it meant hurting herself? Like that? Yes. There is a spirit at the games here that goes far beyond just what the players are doing on the field. It is an overall pride in the amazing university we have here. I mean, we cheer just as much for our Nobel laureates as we do for our sports team. So as we scream our heads off for our team, we cheer not just for our amazing athletes, but for all that we stand for here at the original University of California. I'm Brooks Ischler, Bears fan, Cal, class of 2015. We are the network. I spent a long time feeling sorry for myself, but you got to do what you got to do, and, and in a metaphorically kind of way, you got to hit that pride sign and, and just go after it. When I have to get a, you know, get a bachelor's degree and, and teaching and, and a, a coaching certification and all that, and, uh, you have to take your basics. You know, which brings you back up to speed 
as far as being in school. And starting out, you know, already being out of school, it's gonna be a little harder than if I would've started right out of school. But it should, um, should kick start my, uh, my path to becoming a football coach, getting where I wanna be. I believe this is the, the, the beginning of what it takes to, to get there.